Hello there guys, Golden Light Time back here and happy 2020, happy new year and also new decade which is totally crazy and 2019 felt like only half a year. But yeah, hopefully this coming year and decade is going to be a good one, you know, there are some, some scary things going on, but gotta, gotta try the best of it. Which is partly why I'm making this video, I don't usually do channel updates because I'm not much of a new year resolutions guy because I already you know I'm just one of those people that would just, you know, break it right away, but, but yeah, I'm hoping to make some updates to this channel, hopefully I'll actually be able to keep them, if I don't, you can tell me so. I might be making some channel changes here, but not too much, so no, no fear. But okay, okay, maybe I better address the elephant in the room, my biggest issue slash enemy right now. Kappa. Okay, actually maybe it's more of just YouTube because Kappa has uh, is actually been the ones that have actually been giving us nice updates, so I think more of the issue at this point is what is YouTube going to do with Kappa, not Kappa itself, you know? I was a lot more scared about the situation until I saw Ash's two videos on it and he gave me a lot more hope about it. And he did a good job breaking down the updates that Kappa has actually released. And that maybe possibly when they say kid channel, they mean purely, you know, for kids channels. So I do hang on to a little bit of hope that maybe hopefully that this channel will be just fine. I'm recording this January 1st and I actually haven't seen any of the new effects yet. Maybe there's still work on it, but for now I still have my comments, so hopefully it'll stay that way. However, I'm definitely going to be a lot more careful with the content I make now. Like, not sure if I'm going to be able to do random toy reviews like action figures or Disney Store figures anymore. Which is a shame, because the Spider-Man figurines were one of my first videos and my first video to get over a thousand views. And I would usually pick toys that wouldn't be reviewed very much, so it was fun to review them. I mean, I guess I didn't do the most of those reviews ever, but yeah, I'm worried about if I do those again. I still, of course, obviously want to make this channel Lego related, because that's just the thing I'm into. And one of my main things this year is, honestly, I want to start doing more LEGO stop motions. Because I haven't been doing as much stop motions as I've been wanting to, but when I do them, I really enjoy them. And plus, one of my secret uh, dreams and slash passions is movie making, so that could be a close little movies that I can have for this channel. And plus, when I do a few stop motions, you guys do seem to, for the most part, enjoy it. That and Ashton Flash claimed that Kappa said that stop motion animators would not be affected, so just one way of defending myself while still doing something I wouldn't do. And not too long ago, I even did, a, I went back and did a, a audio commentary for my stop motions, and it actually was a lot more successful than I expected it to be. And really enjoyed the comments too, a lot of people uh, came in uh, commenting and telling how much they liked my stop motion, gave me some good stop motion tips, so really appreciate that. So honestly, I want to do more of that stuff this coming year, uh, more movies, stop motions, and commentary. Speaking of movies, that's definitely the other thing that I love besides Lego. So I was trying to mix the two together with them in a channel, thus, you know, Star Wars and Marvel lookbacks, and of course the trailer thoughts slash reaction videos, which you guys do actually seem to enjoy. However, I do sometimes wonder, like, if, like, you know, doing a, a movie and Lego channel, like, is, if that was a really good mix or if I should really be separating them. So that's why earlier this year I also created a, a movie channel, Daniel's Movies. And I don't have as much content there as I have here, but I do want to work on more movie videos over there. Like maybe even possibly if I finish Star Wars Look Back, then I might be moving some of the lookbacks to over there. And I really enjoy making videos like the lookbacks, and I almost kind of wish to do more like movie video essays. So hopefully I can make more of that type of stuff over there. Even though maybe it might be hard because, yeah, you try balancing two YouTube channels sometimes. Yeah, don't know how Brick Tech does it either. So now, with all that said, I'm gonna close down this channel now because I'm too afraid of Kappa. Bye! JK, JK, as long as my channel doesn't get affected, I'm gonna try to stick around. Again, I'm just gonna be more careful with the content that I make, and I'm also gonna try to work more on my own little films and stop motions if I can. My problem is these things can may, uh, take a little bit more longer time than normal videos, so if I do start focusing on that more, apologies if my Content isn't as frequent. Oh, and also with my little film stop motions, I could use some extra animators, so if any of you guys are interested. And hopefully I can also talk about more films, whether it's doing lookbacks here or if it's on the other channel. But yeah, despite Kappa and YouTube trying to kill itself, hopefully it can make the best of things here. And we can have another great year of content in 2020. So, here's to that. Anyways, thank you for watching this video, and uh, comment down below, let me know what you think of my changes here. Am I making some good moves here? And also let me know what content exactly do I have on my channel here that you enjoy the most. I, I would appreciate that feedback. And it would also be good for knowing what videos I should really be enjoying on. And one way of doing that is by liking the video and letting me know that you enjoyed it. And of course, if you wanted to see for sure what's going to happen here, be sure to stay tuned and subscribe if you're not. And if you are subscribed, I appreciate the support. 
but keep an eye out um, for my future videos as always, especially because I might have a little surprise stop motion video coming up that may or may not have something to do with YouTube and Kappa. A little parody video series, you could say. Anyways, thanks again uh, for uh, wa uh, watching. Happy New Year, and also welcome to the Roaring 2020s, new decade. You guys are awesome, and well, see you next time, and hopefully I'll still be around then.